Hi, Lauren. Great to see you. Good to see you too, Fergal. So you're going to be doing next week the dip for diagnosis on May 30th for MS Ireland and you have a fundraiser. We'll actually put the link in it below so people can contribute to that. So what's your plan? How do you plan to do it? Uh, I'm planning on going out to a local beach of mine and doing a swim. My best friend is going to come along with me and join along for the swim with me. And so, where is that? Where is the local uh, beach? Planning on doing it at Borough Beach. It's in Bad Where's that? Bad Oil. Okay. So hopefully the weather, I don't want to like in Dublin, but it's a little bit chilly. I even have my woolly jumper yeah. on. So hopefully the weather. Right, like, do you go swimming at the moment or is this uh, your first when, swim of the year? It's when it's sunny, I go out swimming then. Okay. Well, fair play to you. So that'll be Thank exciting. You. It's great that you got your friend. And tell us why are you doing it? Uh, I just really want to raise awareness for MS and um to kind of bring it up because not many people know about it. I well, personally for me, the amount of people like my age don't really know about MS. And I said it to people in my year group and they were so surprised. They have no idea what it was. And um I just want to get people to know about it. That's really why I'm That's doing nice. it. And tell us, um, you have MS yourself, don't you? Yeah. So when you said your friend group, did they know that you had MS? Only some of them um, mm. knew about it. Um, it was kind of like very much a shock to many others when I did tell them. Um, but yeah, only a very few people knew. Okay. And tell us, so when did you, so it's actually dip for diagnosis on May 30th. So it's, yeah. the emphasis around diagnosis. And for yourself, how long ago, when did you find that out? I was diagnosed of January last year um, in Temple Street. So that's when I was diagnosed with this. Okay. And was that a long process? Did it take a few months or how? It was actually quite a quick process. Um, okay. I went into my GP and she sent me in to go and get tested in Temple Street. She she thought I had something completely different. I had loads of tests done. I had to get bloods, um, but x-rays done then got an mri and the mri was kind of like when they kind of saw the lesions on my brain and my spine and then i had to get a spinal tap and then it was kind of quick enough and then my consultant told me that that's what they're thinking i had and then i was fully diagnosed with ms then and how was that that day when you found that out scary <laughs> i do have to say i was very much in shock didn't really know what it was so when I was told that I had something that I had no idea what it was, it was very scary. Um, but I had a lot of support from the hospital and then Emma's Ireland themselves. Like I was talking to Cash and she helped me a lot with understanding what I have and it calmed me down a lot. And now I've come to terms with this and pretty good now. I was talking to your mother this week and she was just saying about how you're so positive by nature and how positive you've been in the last year. Yeah. So, I mean, that's a, that's a great attitude to have. Like, have you found that yourself that as time has gone on and the more you found out of it, that it's, it's, you know, you're more positive about it. And yeah, I say I'm very, I'm quite positive about it. Like I forget I have it sometimes. It isn't until like I'm taking medication, I'm like, oh yeah, I do have this. I'm living like a pretty normal life, just keeping up a healthy routine, constantly like doing some type of workout, going on walks every single day and just trying to keep up a good lifestyle. So I stay good, exactly. basically. Well, listen, I'm so delighted that you're doing the dip for a diagnosis. And as I say, we'll put up the fundraising link here. And if other people are still plenty of time, we have another week to go before. So if people want to join us. The plan is we're hoping for throughout Ireland, 10,000 people to do it. Yeah. To do the dip for the 10,000 people in Ireland uh, with MS. So we're trying to get those numbers out on the day. I have a good feeling it's bound to be sunny. I remember it was last year for May 30th. So hopefully yeah. again this year. Yeah. It's a good thing to do. I think like loads of people should know, do it, get out. Exactly. Well, listen, thank you so much and the best of luck with it. Thank you so much.